The global chaos caused by the spread of the coronavirus pandemic continues to affect the world of sport. In Kenya, a group of foreign athletes who were training in the country have now had, to, have now had their races cancelled. CGTN's Sadiq Shaban finds out what their next plan of action is. Every season, athletes from around the world travel to Kenya to train in the high-altitude areas. It's a long-running tradition that gives foreign athletes a chance to travel to Kenya and train with the country's elite runners before major competitions abroad. But things are different this year. The spread of coronavirus around the world continues to threaten every aspect of life, including sporting events around the world, which have now been cancelled or pushed forward. Uh, how should I explain? Like, uh, a little bit sad, understandable also because of the virus, but also like, yeah, I'm here to train, <laughs> to get strong. Yeah, let's see what happens. Maybe they will um, like give us another date to run for the marathon. I'm very lucky in Australia. Um, there hasn't been many issues with uh, cancelled marathons, but I hear uh, in other places of the world there is. Um, yeah, so I'm a bit ignorant to everything that's going on <laughs> with the cancellations, but hopefully nothing else gets cancelled from here. Most of these foreign athletes had skipped the cold season abroad for a sunny summer training in Kenya. Kenya is among countries with confirmed cases of coronavirus, prompting a dramatic shift of plans for these athletes. Some are scared they'll be stranded in Kenya as more countries are restricting travels to pandemic jurisdictions. I mean, certainly my federation feels that way, which is why I'm heading back. I, um, I don't know. I, I just feel like... Um, I just feel like I don't know what's going to happen more or less right now. Um, so much has happened even over the last week that I don't know how quickly things are going to progress. Uh, we were planning to stay here for two, two more weeks, so nine weeks total. But with the virus and all the travel restrictions starting to come about, we decided to go home earlier just to make sure we don't get stuck here and we're at home, you know, which is nice to comfort of having those comforts if things, you know, were to go very south worldwide. So, uh, yeah, so, I mean... Still, seven weeks here was like still awesome, so can't complain too much, but yeah, it's a little unfortunate. Kenya's doing an exceptional job of keeping the people here safe, um, and if they can control that, that'll be, that'll be great, that if they, you can prevent it from spreading here, um, that's, that's huge to stop it. Some of them have chosen to extend their stay in Kenya despite the situation, hoping to finish their tour and training program. When they came to Kenya, foreign athletes did not imagine they would be compelled to cancel their training program due to the global chaos caused by the spread of the coronavirus. With nothing to prepare for at the moment, there is very little to do here other than to keep safe away from infections. Sadiq Shaban, CGTN, Initen, Kenya.